on a picnic. With him? Yes. Before breakfast. Mother, what's happening to you? You were doing so well. God damn it, Anne. Stop playing nursemaid. Isn't that why I came back here? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean that. It's all right. It's my fault. I, I've been on edge. You've been seeing a lot of him. Why not? It's the first man I've been interested in since I came home. But Anne, you, you hardly know him. I know. That's what I'm trying to do. Get to know him. And he worries me. Now, call it instinct, call it whatever you like, but I don't trust him. He, he's after something here. I don't know what, but something. What's wrong? I don't understand. I, I don't understand what you're talking about. <laughs> Mom, you wouldn't believe how great Pete was today. You were great. He made it look so real, just as if he was your son. Anyway, you made an old lady very happy. Why would my mother-in-law mistake you for Jeff? I don't understand. You don't, you don't look like Jeff. You don't talk like Jeff. Believe me, I was as surprised as you were. I mean, why you? She, she has men going in and out of there all the time. She has doctors and, and psychologists and attendants. Men in and out of that room all the time. Why would she think you were my husband? Mother. Mother, I don't know why you're making such a big thing out of this. 